Linux Kernel 6.7 is the latest stable version of the Linux kernel, released on January 7, 2024. It introduces several new features and improvements, such as Bikachev's file system, a copy-on-write KOW file system that aims to combine the modern features of BTRFs and ZFS with the speed and performance of XT4 and XFS. Intel Lunar Lake Support the kernel adds support for Intel's next-generation Meteor Lake processors and graphics, as well as the rest of the Lunar Lake platform. NVIDIA GSP Firmware Support The Nuvo open-source graphics driver can now use the GPU system processor, GSP, firmware on NVIDIA hardware, which may improve power management and performance. USB Type-C Additions The kernel includes new drivers and expanded support for USB Type-C devices such as DP Alt Mode 2.1 and La Jolla Cove Adapter, LJCA. Enhanced support for Lenovo devices. The kernel improves the handling of auxiliary MAC addresses and suspend resume functionalities for ThinkPad keyboards. EDAC driver for Xilinx's Versal Integrated Memory Controller. Kernel adds a new driver that supports Xilinx's memory controller technology, which is used in some FPGA devices. File system and storage improvements. The kernel enhances the performance and efficiency of XD4, BTRFs, and F2FS file systems, as well as zoned block devices, networking enhancements. The kernel introduces new features and optimizations for TCP IP, IPsec, MPTCP, VSOCK, MCTP, and VXLAN protocols, as well as PTP timestamping and Netlink GET for MDB. Virtualization and Architecture Support the kernel expands its support for KVM virtualization on Lungarch and RISC-V architectures, as well as various enhancements for ARM and RISC-V platforms. Linux kernel 6.7 is available on some of the latest or upcoming versions of popular Linux distributions, such as Arch Linux. Arch Linux should receive 6.7 sometime during the first two weeks of February 2024. Ubuntu Ubuntu should see Linux kernel 6.7 for version 24.04, which is expected to be released in April 2024. Fedora Fedora 40, which should be released around April 2024, might use Linux kernel 6.7 by default. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you found it informative and useful. If you enjoyed it, please consider subscribing to my channel and hitting the bell icon to get notified of new videos. Your support means a lot to me and helps me create more quality content for you.